Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel, Diamonds and Washi. My name is Katie and today I am here with an unboxing, unenveloping from a brand new shop in the community, a small shop in the community called DIY or Diamond Delights. And you guys, what's in here is so ridiculously cute and I'm so excited to share it with you all. They just launched a week or two ago, I think, and I had heard about them through my friend Sophie at the Diamond Help Desk. So thanks for that heads up, Sophie. And I went over to their website and they had such adorable little snack size kits and stickers that are licensed that I decided to pick up a few to share with you guys. So um, it's it came all in this kind of like flat mailer here and it actually just arrived today. So I'm Really looking forward to getting into it with you guys so um i will link to the shop of course directly as well as their instagram and i just want to make sure there's not gonna be like an invoice in here that i'm gonna pull out and show you okay so here is how everything is packaged i did get a variety of of goodies here let's see is that that is everything okay so here is um a little insert that they included so they've got instagram tiktok and then yeah no that's my full name <laughs> so a little thank you note as well so all packaging is recyclable and reusable so that's great now i did take a look and as of the time of this filming and posting it looks like they're only shipping within the u.s and you know we'll see if maybe they expand international at some point but just fyi um it looks like they're just within the U.S. at the moment. So um, I have the cat cup of coffee, the cinnamon cat, and then this is a set of stickers that's the cat curry set two. This is really adorable packaging. Uh, let's get into these. These are kind of the little mini snack size kits. Look at these first. I like don't want to rip this because it's so cute. And I am kind of thinking that maybe I'll work on one of these with you guys, like do a little time lapse and show you how they, they turn out. But let's take a look at them first and see. Okay, so here is, it's a sticker, like an actual sticker, that's adorable. And then, oh, stop it, that is so cute. So like I said, this is licensed artwork. Angela Mary Vaz, it looks like, is the artist. And this is it, this is Cinnamon Cat, and it's got, oh, these are even, those are pre-cut, you guys. So even though this is just a little snack size kit, we do get these pre-cut sticker labels, which is awesome. It looks like this is just, yeah, like a thin plastic film here and it is sticky. It's not like, yeah, it's, I mean, it's, it's a good sticky. Um, and the glue is just on that part, but over here it's not, you know, it's not sticky. It's just sticker paper you can, you can peel up. And this is also a sticker that you can see it's cut so you can, you know, once you put diamonds on it, you can take it off of here and, you know, put it somewhere uh, as a sticker. So that is adorable. And then it looks like the diamonds are in here. And I love the concept of some just really cute snack size kits. Snack size kits are just smaller diamond paintings that, you know, a regular size diamond painting is like a full meal. These are snacks, you know, it's nice to have some smaller kits in the mix to work on. Now, this kit has square diamonds, and I I don't know if they're all square diamond stickers. They do have some rounds as well, and they did say on the website that their squares are resin, and we've got the color code printed right there. I think what I would probably do, well, I might just leave this on here to function as a legend that I don't move, but you could peel these off and put these directly on the bags if you wanted, but I'm probably just going to leave it right there for sake of ease um, but these do come in these resealable bags that yeah these absolutely look look like resin diamonds so hopefully there's going to be minimal trash minimal trouble with these these drills if you find yourself running into static which is sometimes an issue with resealable bags in particular though you know even heat seal bags have it too um i recommend getting a dryer sheet and cutting it up into squares and that typically you know tucking that into the bags would help with static if you have it i am so enamored with this whole packaging and presentate and presentation i think it's adorable i love that everything is labeled you know exactly how it all goes together um and i love that it comes with this like actual coordinating sticker and you can kind of see how it's going to look too if you look on the shop's instagram you can see that she has or the owner uh, has completed 
uh, a few of, if not all of the ones that she actually has in the shop. So you can kind of see how they're going to turn out. The other snack size, you know, kit sticker that I got is the cat cup of coffee. And we'll take a look at this. They have, I think five or six of these snack stickers like in this size and they had a, a few of the like mini sticker sets that i'll show you but first we'll look at this one here is the sticker that goes with it way too cute way too cute and then here is the actual diamond painting same artist i think this is the one that i want to do i think this is the one that i want to do with you guys as a time lapse it's just so cute i love that they're all very like <coughs> themed together that's adorable same exact features as the other one in terms of this is cut out so you could use it as a sticker and put it somewhere um, it's got the poured glue it's got the pre-cut kind of stickers over here this is just something like the overall packaging and presentation and setup here is something that i just feel like i haven't really seen before and i i love it i love something new um and i love the very obvious kind of care and attention to detail that went into this by the shop owner it just it's a really beautiful product from just my first impressions here like to have right out the gate at launch i feel like is very it's really nice and it's really impressive uh same thing we have resealable bags with the dmc code stickers on here same kind of color family just lots of warm browns and some peaches and ivories love it yeah i'm leaning towards working on this one <laughs> It's so cute. Now, I probably am not going to actually, you know, peel this off like as a sticker and put it on something. I'm just kind of going to leave it as is because it's just so cute. I don't want to mess it up. <laughs> but that is Cat Cup of Coffee. And then last, let's take a look at this sticker set, which is, I think, a set of smaller stickers. This is Cat Curry Set 2. And that, yeah, like I said, there were a few different sticker sets that they had few different combinations of different foods and snacks on these stickers and I just went with the one that was kind of speaking to me so let's see okay make sure we got everything out of there yes okay so this one came with this little cute boba cat sticker <laughs> so cute and then oh my gosh these are adorable so so cute so we have like some macarons we have another little coffee it could be like a little matchy with the bigger one and then like a croissant or i feel like a cat sant <laughs> uh is that like a like a lollipop or like ice cream on a stick and then we've got like our little boba over here and then we have this set of stickers and DMCs. So um, there are a little bit more in the way of colors going on here. This is so cute. I just, I cannot get over it. This is so stinking adorable. Um, these are all obviously kind of pre-cut stickers as well. And then if you peel back the plastic cover, these are stickle, sticker labels that you can peel off. And then we have just the poured glue where the drills are gonna go. I I cannot believe how cute this is. This is ridiculous. <laughs> so we're gonna have the colors in here. I'm trying so hard not to rip these stick these like label stickers because they're they're so pretty. <laughs> I, I I will admit I am a sucker for really pretty aesthetics and presentation. I you know that's you'll you'll get me really quickly with that. <laughs> Okay, so these have round diamonds. Um, so both of the others were squares. These stickers though are rounds. And it said on the website that currently their rounds are acrylic, but they're shifting to resin rounds. To be honest with you, I typically, I don't have an issue with acrylic round diamonds. I don't mind, especially in a context like this. Um, Acrylic rounds are much less problem prone than acrylic squares, so that's just not a big deal. This is just a delightful mix of pastel colors and goodness. I love this so much. And it's the same thing, resealable bags with a DMC code on here. Again, I think I'm probably just going to leave these labels here. It'll just be really easy to reference, I think. Um, you know, look for the symbol, look for the DMC, grab the bag. I don't know that in a tiny kit like this, it's going to save me a ton of time, but I really like that they offer that feature. That is a really, really nice feature. 
Um, man, I want to like work on all of these, but I also want to save some of them because they're just too cute. Okay, so um, just a really quick recap. What we've got here is the cat curry. This is, I specifically got this set too, but there's at least one or two other sets on there. We have the cinnamon cat and we have the cat cup of coffee. I think I'm going to work on the cat cup of coffee with you guys. And I'm really tempted to do up one of these stickers as well, just to see how the round drills are. And then I could kind of share my thoughts with you on that, but I'm going to start with a cat cup of coffee and I'm going to put you into time-lapse mode so you can work on it alongside me. I think it's going to be really cute and really fun. Um, and I'll get to show you how it looks like uh, what it looks like once it's complete so okay let's get started <laughs> Okay, you guys, so that was maybe half an hour tops. This went really quickly doing these and it was really, really fun actually. So obviously I did this one first, the cat cup of coffee and just color blocked my way through that. The drills are really nice, they lined up well. I accidentally like got some putty on here. You probably saw me struggling to get rid of that. But this is really darn cute. The drills are nice quality. There's a little bit of like minor yapping. Um, and the glue, like the drills are wanting to shift just a tiny bit. But you know what, you guys, I'm not going to be fussy about like a a little sticker, a little cute snack size sticker. Um, but I think this is just absolutely adorable and was just very zen and relaxing to work on. And I think this one was about <clears throat> 15 to 20 minutes. And as you saw, I was multi-placing my way through that. There was a tiny bit of static in the bag. So I just kind of breathed a little bit of like hum a humid breath in there. And that really took care of it pretty easily. I had plenty of diamonds. They were all excellent quality with just really, really minimal trash. Um, I loved it. This was really, really, really cute. And I'm excited to do this one and like want to go buy all of the rest as well. And then I just did the one little sticker with the round drills because I just kind of wanted to try them out and no issues with the diamonds at all. It's really cute. It's definitely a different style of sticker. You can't really, not really easily multi-place these. Like you could put more than one diamond on your multi-placer and kind of try to align them or single place with a multi-placer and it'd be fine. But I just enjoy single placing my way through that because I'm not feeling a rush. I feel like these are the kind of projects that are just nice to work on when you're trying to relax, not rush through them. So this was really, really cute. And I kind of wish I would have done one of the ones that had like some of the like light greens and light pinks and stuff, but that's really okay. But we were a little boba kitty. Um, just, I have to say, I love these. I think that these are absolutely adorable. I love the, the overall presentation and the packaging, which like I said, I admittedly, um, I really am a sucker for that kind of thing. But when you've got these little snack size things, I feel like that really can just take it to the next level. I love supporting a small shop. I love that the artwork, like they've credited an artist, so you know who has done this artwork and, and rendered these. They're obviously hand charted. Uh, this is just a really, really, really cute and unique thing <laughs> that I'm finding out there. And so um, I go and take a look, you guys. Go and take a look. Like I said, I believe that at the moment they're just shipping within the US, but maybe they'll open that up at some point. Um, 
I'm not sure how much stock they have in at the moment or what they're planning to get back in, but I think that they currently have a free shipping threshold of $50 US dollars. Uh, so maybe this gives you a sense for kind of hopefully what to expect. Um, I just, if you like the art, I say go for it. <laughs> if you want something that's just really relaxing and snack size to work on in between other big projects or to travel with, or honestly to give these as gifts, this would be a really cute gift, whether it's for you know a little one or just to someone that maybe hasn't done diamond painting before and you want to give them something that is adorable, not too big and overwhelming and beautifully presented in my opinion, I think that this could be a really, really good thing to check out. Again, the name of the shop is DIY or Diamond Delights. And I think that the L is capitalized because it's like, it's a light project. That's just my guess. I'm not sure. But I'll link to their Instagram. I'll link to their shop. Go and take a look. Let me know in the comments if you're going to go pick anything up and what your thoughts are. Um, and I'm going to be following along on their Instagram to see, you know, if they come up and, with, and uh, release any other kinds of sets and artwork as well. But yay, love a small shop. Go and check them out, you guys. Thanks for watching. I hope it was fun to see these kind of come together and see a new shop. Feel free to subscribe <clears throat> if you want to stay up to date with my diamond painting videos, I try to do um, a lot of different unboxings from a lot of different small shops in the community. And I'll do reviews where you'll get to see completed things like this and tutorials, all sorts of stuff. I'd love to have you here. Thanks so much for watching, my friends. I hope you have a day and a week that's as amazing as you are. And I'll talk to you in the next one. Bye. Mm -hmm.